And hello. Hello. Just my luck. All of the runners gone. Yeah, gone. They're already all the way you in Sacramento. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but. Oh, yeah, I, I clearly did. Um, no, we, we were not going to catch up to them. So I decided for this first hour, I wanted to talk to the people that are out here working really, really hard. Because if you think about it, there are nearly 10,000 runners from all over the world here this morning in Folsom. And they're heading to Sacramento, to the capital. So it's got to take a lot of teamwork, hard work. And it's these folks right over here. So look at all this trash that they have to clean up this morning. We see, you know, the, the excitement, everybody running out, but we don't see this. So what's your name? Alex. Oh. Alex. So Alex, are you volunteering here this morning? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Girl, you are picking up all of this trash left by nearly 10,000 people. Mm -hmm. So why do you come out and help out? I mean, this is the 37th year, so it's a really big deal. Oh, it's a pleasure to do so. I mean, you get to support runners and fellow family members and all that good stuff. Yeah, and are you a runner yourself? Yeah, that's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, but you you took you took a time off for this one. 26 <laughs> miles wasn't for you. Uh, well, I'm a collegiate athlete, so oh, yeah. Girl, okay, never mind. Because what I saw that it was a marathon, I mean, 26 miles. I can't even do one mile. So I give it up to you. I'm sorry you gotta pick up all the trash and everything, no but worries. you know, it's thanks to people like you that we keep this area clean. And look at this, all of these people, they're volunteering out here, but we're gonna be live in the final stages where they end the race and we're gonna bring you all of those runners. We're gonna talk to them, but uh, for now, I'm going to toss it to you in the studio because uh, I think I need to start helping them out a little bit. That's a lot of, that's a lot of things left that's behind. a lot of things. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you oh got to peel goodness. all that stuff off. So many coats. Wow. That is I always wonder, do, do they, all these coats? Well, right, I always wonder, do they come back and get their jackets or they just, I think they know. Do they come back and get their jackets? Good morning. Good morning. Um, if they want their stuff back, we have an organized gear check that they put their okay. clear bags. The dogs are sniffing. We transport that to the finish line for them. Okay. Uh, people toss their clothes. They know they're not getting them back, but we actually have a Goodwill truck staged back there. It's part oh, of the plan. That's sustainability awesome. is really important. Love us that. I love so that. We're going to have the Goodwill truck come through, collect all of the stuff, and we actually have another one staged a ways no, down so we can sweep the whole course as well. Oh, oh awesome. Answer. Well, thank you so much. There you go, Ashley. Your yeah. question answered. Thank you so much. I always <laughs> wondered. I know I know because it's such a long run. Mm -hmm. People strip throughout the run, but I never knew what ended up happening with the clothing. A gear dump. A gear dump.